guys, now I've finished the uh, manual recirculation, I can grab the camera and have a decent uh, decent talk on it. And I've just pulled the grains out of the boiler and just bring it up to the boil. So yeah, this beer is um, it's, it's an American wheat and I'm going to call it Fool's Gold. And the reason for that is I'm going to be using these Jester hops that were kindly sent to me by Ant Rogerson. And also, um, I use one of the vouchers from, or some of the vouchers from Mick at Beanham's Home Brew for the uh, for the grains. So thank you very much, Ant and Mick. So um, yeah, this brew day is uh, sponsored by them. So yeah, now we've finished the recirculation. The rest of the brew day should be fairly uh, fairly smooth, hopefully. So yeah, while it's coming up to the boil, I've just got a somewhere in here. Oh, here it is, stainless steel ruler. I'm just gonna check my pre-boil volume and um, yeah we'll come back now just one other thing the jester I'm just going to do all late additions because I'm just going to bit it to a between 20 and 25 IBUs um, so yeah we'll just try and use as much as we can at the end okay guys we are nearly 50 minutes through the boil I've put the uh, work chiller in to sterilize it so we're just going to do some late additions so I've got 25 grams of jester at 10 25 grams at 5 and 30 at uh, for a steep so yeah we'll be back shortly when we button the first lot on cheers okay so first hop drop the 25 grams of jester I've got uh, half a worth lot so we'll chuck those in a five minute drop going in, another 25 grams. Smelling really good actually, never, no experience with Jester hops but beautiful aroma. Okay, so we've cooled the wort down to just under 80 degrees. So I'm going to put in the uh, hop stand hops, 30 grams. Chuck those in now. Here we go, and we'll let that sit for, I don't know, probably f at least 15 minutes. Okay, I've finished the hop stand, and I'm just cooling the wort down at the moment. Um, not expecting to get much below about 28, as the groundwater temperature is about 25 or something. So, yeah, we'll carry on with that, and uh, see you shortly. Cheers. Okay guys, just transferring into the fermenter, unfortunately, well, because of my groundwater temperature, I couldn't get down below 35, so I am going to finish it off in the fridge, so yeah, just uh, transferring it now, and okay guys, uh, here's the uh, finished sample I showed you before, I've just um, put the fermenter into the new fridge here. And I'm just finishing off cooling it down. Still got to pitch the yeast, but um, yeah, shouldn't be too far away. So, yeah, so we'll uh, have a quick taste of the sample. As you guys know, at this stage, it's mainly tastes of uh, sort of sweet wort and um, yeah, a little bit of bitterness from the hops coming through, but tastes tastes pretty good. Nothing, um, nothing off there. So yeah, we'll see how that goes. So thanks for watching, guys. First brew done in uh, three months. So happy, just happy to have a beard, you know, underway. To be honest. And thanks again to Ant for the Jester hops and Mick for the um, the vouchers I won from your competition that allow me to buy the uh, malts and the yeast. So uh, yeah, cheers, guys. We will catch you once the beer is ready to drink. Over and out. Cheers.